We're just going to ask you a question here. <clears throat> okay, What's go. It? Ready? Yeah, it's really hot here, isn't it? It's I'm sorry, I'm sorry really to sound like you. Right? I can't wait. I can't wait <laughs> I'm not alone on stage. Number 221. Yes. Oh, the big gay rainbow's falling. <laughs> Number 221. What's the last thing you stole? Oh, um, an Urban Decay box of eyeshadow when I was 16 at school. It's That's really bad. I know it's all, you stole? I mean, yeah, yeah. I went through a kleptomaniac phase for like, for like a month because I'd never stolen before. I was quite a good girl. And I went, oh, I'm going to steal loads. And I stole this big box of Urban Decay eyeshadow. It was worth around £40. It was ridiculous. But boots, it's very easy. Is it really? <laughs> it was very easy, yeah. To this day? No, that was back in the day. It's quite okay. a while ago. So, yeah. I stole a corn cob pipe once and got arrested for it. A what? It was awful. A corn you know, cob pipe? You know those little pipes made out of corn cobs? No. I'm not familiar with them. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? I know. <laughs> Fucking hairy Americans and their corn cob Sweaty pipes. Sweaty bastards. <laughs> A corn cob pipe. So I went in to get a prescription. Can you play music on this pipe? No. Okay. It's just like it's like a smoking pipe. It's like a you know it's you know it's a yeah. So it's a smoking. Why are you doing Fargo voice? It's the only accent I can do. It's the only accent I can do. But it's a corn cob pipe, and I went in there and got a prescription filled, and then I tried to steal it, and I didn't really think that they would have my name up there, and and they did indeed as they were filling my prescription, and I tried running out the door, and they grabbed my shirt and ripped it off me, and then the corn cob pipe fell down. And then they called the police and arrested me. Really? Over a two dollar pipe. Oh my god. Taught me a lesson. That's, de that's democracy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, but the last thing I stole was some cakes from downstairs. <laughs> Probably yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me uh, let me ask you another question. <laughs> Don't tell them. Don't tell them. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, number 59. What unique feature would be in your dream house? Oh, oh, okay. A spiral <laughs> staircase right. in the bedroom up to like a little jacuzzi. Because when I was at school, I used to always draw my houses with a spiral staircase and a jacuzzi above the bed. A jacuzzi right on top of the bed? Yeah, but kind of being up on, on a mezzanine floor, but with the spiral staircase there. <laughs> Wait, so there's a bed and then okay, a jacuzzi so you've got your room, on top of it? You've got your room, you've got your right. bed, you know, nice wardrobe, whatever, and then you've got this little spiral staircase up this mezzanine floor, nice, and a, and a, and a, and a jacuzzi where you could get equally sweaty. And, okay, let me, get, <laughs> let me get a little closer for this question. What? The next question. I can see the sweat dripping down your face. I'm fucking hot, dude, I'm not joking. <laughs> it's too fucking hot up here. Don't wear polyester and they're hot lights. Number 222. If you could have any artwork, I don't oh. like this one. I don't like oh. this one. Yeah. I like that one. Do you really? You yeah, want to okay, answer that? Open it, so. Yeah, it's just kind of boring. Okay. All right, here we go. Ah, number 48. What do you imagine God's outfit looks like? <laughs> I don't know. I don't believe in him, so I don't really think of it. Very All right, well. we'll ask you another question. Okay. All right. Um, He's got a tash like that, though. I bet he does. He does. Four of them in a row. <laughs> 155. What do you need to quit? Being in love. <laughs> um, yes, little Steve. What, ha what happened with this no, guy? No, we don't want to talk about it now. Really? Yeah. You sure? Okay, well, like, yeah, he's ace, but he's just not the man for me. He was at when we started getting out, but not now. I've changed. Quite, I'm, I'm, I'm quite happy with who I am now. Is he not pulling his weight? Yeah, he's re he is quite lazy. Is he really? Yeah. Like, I'm, I'm really good at organizing stuff, and I'm very romantic, and he was just a bit useless at stuff like that. So. Was he romantic in the beginning and then became not romantic? He was, like, for around four months. Did he give you flowers? N he never, ever gave me flowers. Oh. Oh. Let's pick him up. <laughs> That's exactly. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. No, yeah. don't. Lee Stamans. He's, he's broken. Yeah. I'm fine because I'm strong, but he's broken. Is he really? He's broken. <laughs> should we get him? Should we get him on the phone? No way. <laughs> because we can't. We can't do that. No, here. no, 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 no. <laughs> All right, we won't do that. All right, so so this is a third portion of the show. Whatever that Can means. I go now? No, you can't no, go now. Not. No, this is. Oh my God, that's it's, awesome. It's hang on, hang on. Microphone. Yeah. Microphone. Oh God. Do you cool want some yourself of this? down. Cool yourself down. I'll you have a cube. Oh. No, 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 no. Come on. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So, as you know, tonight's uh, tonight's event is uh, or tonight's theme is is competition. Mm. Did you realize that? Yeah, I'm a winner. I like it. 
Yes, you are. Yeah. You know what I've got for you? You know what I've got in my pocket <laughs> for you? What have you got, sir? Hmm? <laughs> oh, a stopwatch. Missing Tooth Award! <laughs> I've never missing tooth. I haven't got my wisdom yet. How can't you play? Yeah, you're right. Okay, here, I'll save this one over here. Yeah. I like myself! Yes, I do. <laughs> I'll wear that one with pride. All right. All right. So you ready for this? Okay. What do I have to do? Well, <clears throat> here's what we're going to do. We have, we have a couple helmets back here. And uh, what we're going to do is we have a bunch of supplies in here. And we are going to make up a new sport. Ooh, fun. Yes, it is. And so basically, we have all these materials. Have some, here's, some, here's some clay. Here's some tape. Here's some of this. Yes. Yes. And so we're just going to put a bunch of things on top of the I helmet. I feel like a kabaddi vibe with this. <laughs> so OK, so what we're going to do is we're going to make a helmet. And we're going to design it. Oh, and then okay. we're going to have to talk about what it's used in our, in our oh, sporting we event that we've designed. Sport. OK. You know what I mean? Do, do you okay. follow me here? Yeah, I follow you. Does everyone follow me? Do, do, do you we know have what sticky I'm talking tape? About? Yes, there is sticky tape. There is. And why, why we do this? I'm not allowed to say sellotape because I'm Let's too see. Big. What, Okay, hang on. Hang on, I gotta figure out what we're doing here. All right, okay. Um, are you ready? How much time do you have to do this? Then? Indigo Moss is gonna play a song, and then we'll have that whoa, time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do we have to do like, okay, do we not have double sided? No, okay. there's stuff. No, 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 okay, we can just do this. Indigo Moss, you ready? Yeah. Take it away. Indigo Moss. Hey. 